A production of theturtleroom.com. Education. Conservation. Survival. Hi, this is Steve, founder of theturtleroom.com. As my first video, I'm going to update you on one of my newer projects, Graptomus oculifera. As many of you may know, I received this group about seven months ago. First, a bit of news. My group of 2.1 will be included in the upcoming AZA Species Survival Program, or Studbook, for the species. I'm very excited about this opportunity to participate in helping meet conservation goals for the ringed map turtle. My oldest male is a beautiful, full-grown specimen at 3 and 3 quarters inches and 107 grams. He has started to show interest in the female, but she is not yet of breeding size. This turtle does have an old injury to his left rear foot, but it doesn't hinder him in any activities. The female has shown some nice growth over the past two months, going from 4.5 to 4 and 3 quarters inches and from 229 to 251 grams. I expect her to need to be over 5 and a quarter inches and 300 grams before she will be big enough to reproduce. The shortest reproducing specimen on record was 5.1 inches. This turtle has now started showing signs of shedding her scutes, and I can't wait to see what her carapace looks like after a good shed. The last member of the group is a young male, about one and a half years old. He is still around 3 inches and 63 grams, showing very slow but steady growth over his seven months with me. As far as their habitat goes, the adult pair lives in a large aquarium with sand and crushed coral substrate, driftwood, and plenty of hideouts and basking spots. When the female shows signs of being closer to reproduction, they will be moved into a more suitable breeding habitat. The young male lives in a separate aquarium with other turtles of similar age and or size to himself. Habitat conditions are nearly identical to the other aquarium. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Again, I'm Steve at theturtleroom.com. Thanks for watching. Please visit theturtleroom.com for more information on this and other exciting colonial species.